Assalamu alaikum. I am Junaid. Uh, today is 6th October 2020. Uh, this is my first video and I will be making YouTube videos about technical updates, technology updates, uh, plus vlogs, plus how to videos or tutorials. Today I will be making a video how to install uh, YouTube video, how to install uh, VirtualBox machine on your PC and then we will be uh, installing an ERP next instance uh, as a machine in VirtualBox and I will guide you through the steps so without further delay let's get started and I will explain you there see you in the video okay so let's start the video now uh, open your any browser I use Chrome so I'm opening the Chrome browser visit virtualbox.org My net is today slow. Okay, you have to click here. Today, my net is very slow. Please bear with me. I don't know what is the reason. Okay. And then you have to press on Windows Host and it will download a uh, VirtualBox uh, .exe file in your download folder. I will not download it again because I have already downloaded it. So I will show you now where to download the ERP Next software. Then we will go to the installation procedure. Go to erpnext.org, not on to the erpnext.com com and .org are two different sites when you are here just click on ERP next get ERP next scroll down to the end and you will click here to download a production image it's a very big file of approximately 1.5 GB it depends on your internet speed it may take uh, between 5 to 10 minutes or 20 minutes depending on your internet speed so I will not download it again because I have already downloaded it and have created a folder on my desktop and both files are sitting there. So let's start the installation process. So these are the two files. VirtualBox. So let's start from the VirtualBox and this is the ERP Next production file of almost 1.8 GB. We click on VirtualBox. Next next and plus yes next it may take some time uh, during the installation so just bear with me I don't want to pause the video and get back here uh, let me explain ERP next is an in, uh, open source ERP software with the all modules included in the software it's not like we do where they charge for each additional for each module for instance like accounting module payroll module um, purchasing and sales module they charge separately ERP next is all together whatever you pay for the subscription you get it subscription is required if you are using their ERP next cloud uh, package otherwise the software is free you can download on your machine and you can use it uh, uh, free of charge it's a very powerful software and uh, I'm using this software since 2015 uh, in my uh, organization where I work here in Saudi Arabia uh, so I will pause this video because it's taking more than uh, usual time and I will get back to you when it is almost near to finish okay so just bear with me so it started installation there was a pop-up here so I have to click on it yes I forgot to press yes when I was talking to you okay so let's just finish the process and virtual box machine will open now this is the virtual box machine this is the existing uh, machine I will delete this machine so I can show you how to install a new one delete all files this is my machine of my other instance so I will keep it here what you have to do you have to click on file import appliance browse to the folder 
either it could be download or wherever you have downloaded the file my file was on the desktop erp next here open next it shows you the uh, specification or the configuration file of the virtual machine with the two cpu four gp ram and all this stuff you don't need to go through details so i will just press on import button and wait for the machine to import It says two minutes remaining. Let's see how long it takes. It's about to finish. few seconds and here we go okay now this machine is powered off you have to press on start button to run the machine I will close this it is starting now you are in Ubuntu login it's a Linux machine by the way so you are here you have to log in okay uh, username frappy and password is frappy so I will type f r a w p e frappy f r a w p e frappy so I am inside okay click on here go to you have to type now to run the ERP software on your local machine you have to type local host column 8080 and here you go uh, the username name is administrator with the a capital and the password is a d m i n you can change it later on when you get into the software you can change it on later on okay over login is successful it will guide you through the visit to set up your uh, ERP next software I will not guide you through the setup process because every organization has different uh, requirements it's different setup requirements but ERP next software is installed and it is working uh, now it's time to stop the video or close the video then my next video will be to uh, to do to restore the backup in the ERP cloud machine the backup which you are using on the uh, ERP next cloud so for instance I have a ERP next cloud account I will be downloading the backup and I will be restoring this backup here in this machine in front of you so if you like this video please subscribe to my channel hit the like button and see you in my next video bye